Hi there, welcome to PA Consulting Pro and welcome to this another episode of PA Consulting Pro where I'm going to teach you something very interesting. We are living in the world of data and AI and here if you really want to grow in your career into data and analytics or data science or AI, then it is very important that you do certain certifications. But how to do that? Because certifications are getting quite expensive day by day. Well, if you are also willing to grow in your career in data and analytics or maybe into any other cloud-based technology, then this video is for you. In this video, I'm going to let you know about it, how you can earn a free or discounted certification. I'm going to let you know how you can get 50% discount, 75% discount, or maybe 100% discount on your exam certifications. Not only that, after this video, you will get to know a particular part that how you can learn more and more related to data or cloud-based technologies. If you really want to know more, please stay tuned with me till the end of this video and I'm going to let you know everything about it. However, if you are over here for the very first time, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel and hit the bell icon so that you always stay updated with our latest videos and contents. Now, without any further ado, let's get started. Alright guys, first of all, why do we really need the certifications and how we can earn it? for free or at a discounted prices. Well, it's been a decade that cloud technology has disrupted this entire IT industry and not IT industry, all other industry. And now for the last one and a half year, we are going too much into the world of AI. And with the help of that, we are becoming more efficient and also it's disrupting all the challenges that we were facing previously. We are becoming more and more agile. We are doing a lot of automations and I'm sure you are also using the chat GPT, perplexity, and there are so many other copilots offered by Microsoft. Why we are using them? Well, these are helping us a lot. That's why we are using them, but how to use them, how they have been designed, what is the technology working behind them and how you can also grow into the data and AI field, or maybe any other cloud-based technology that you were working previously or working now, how you can grow into your career. Well, for that, you have to learn. You have to learn all the latest skills that can be in the data and analytics field or that can be something else. Maybe you want to grow into the data science field or machine learning or something else. Well, for all of this, one thing is common. And that thing is that you have to learn. You have to learn the new skills. But how to learn it? Where to learn it? Well, I'm not sure about the other platforms like AWS, Google Cloud, etc. though I have very fair idea that how you can go there. There are so many different websites available. You can go there, you can start learning from their documentation, etc. But here today I'm going to talk about Microsoft. In Microsoft, we are going to talk about Microsoft Azure and its related technologies because Microsoft's cloud platform is based on Microsoft Azure. So whether you are working with the Microsoft Fabric, Power BI, or Power Automate, or Power Apps, etc., Power Platform, they all are based on Microsoft Azure. And Microsoft Azure is the cloud technology offered by Microsoft. Now the question comes from where you can learn and how you can earn discounted or free certifications. Free certification and discounted certifications are essential. Why? Because we all can't afford these expensive certifications, but still they want to grow in their career. They want to learn something new. And I'm here to help those people. Although you can also claim in certain organizations, if you're working for a company, they also offer a lot of budget for your learning. Now, you can either claim from your own organization or you can follow the path that I'm going to show you. Now, look at my screen. Over here on Google, you have to type Microsoft Cloud Skills Challenge. So this is the challenge where you challenge yourself. You would learn yourself. You have to spend time over there. There would be certain question and answers that you have to answer. There would be lab exercises that you have to complete over there. I do myself. I have done tons of, I'm going to probably show you as well, where you can see my portfolio. You can build your own portfolio. But before all that, you have to create one Microsoft account that you can create with your own personal email address. And also you can see your, all the certifications under your dashboard over there. Now let's click over there. You would find this Microsoft Cloud Skills Challenge. Click over here. It would take some time to load. And here you can see that start your journey. And on the screen, you would find that there's a lot of information. Now you can earn a Microsoft credential. That means you can complete your journey over there, your Cloud Skills Challenge. After that, you are going to receive, a, receive an email that you have completed this certification. And later on, you may also get another email where you would get a discounted voucher, which you can apply. We are also going to do that. We are also going to see that how you can do that. So there are lots of different options over here, whether you want to learn Azure, Microsoft 365, Microsoft Power Platform, Security, etc. So let's go with Microsoft Azure, which is saying Fabric Analytics Engineer. So the exam code is DP600. You can get started over here. 
just click over here so first you have to register for this one and here you can see that you you will have 30 days to complete this challenge so guys if you really want to appear for microsoft fabric certification or any other please come to this website i'm going to provide you all the links in the description section so you can check it out and you can start your journey from there now you have to first register over here so let's say begin now and here you have to go with your personal account so i have another account which i really would like to use so i'm going to say personal account but this is not the one i'm going to use but it takes automatically because it's associated and here you can see that my account is Ajay Sharma 2061 and here also you would get the message that congratulations you have completed this challenge because I have already completed my Microsoft Fabric certification and even the challenge as well and this challenge has been ended. Now the question comes how you would get to know about these challenges well you have to subscribe for Microsoft information letter where you would get to know that when certain challenges is going to get started alternatively you can subscribe to our channel and also our Instagram page where I always post it whenever there's a new challenge is coming and that's definitely going to help you a lot to get to know when you can enroll into one particular challenge or how and when to earn your free certifications so once you complete this challenge over here you go through all the modules you learn everything over there you do practice yourself after that you are going to receive an email that you have completed your AI skills challenge it is something else that I just recently completed the AI skills challenge and you are going to get this badge as well you can and post it onto your LinkedIn you can show off your skill that you have learned it and it's very inspiring it's gonna inspire the other people as well so please share on your LinkedIn profile after a certain time you're gonna also get another email that hey this is your exam voucher and you can schedule an exam and this is gonna give me completely one free certification 100% free I don't need to pay any money over there over here you should also remember that certain times it's not going to give you complete free certification it can also provide you 50 percent discount or if you are a microsoft certified trainer then you can claim up to 75 percent discount as well and i'm going to show you that one as well so please stick with me once you do that you have to take your code and you have to schedule your exam now there's also one other website where you can learn a lot of new things over here so here you would come and here you are going to click on this showcase your skill so just click on this and here you would learn whether you want to go for Microsoft Applied Skills or you want to go for Microsoft Certifications. If you really want to go for any certifications, you can come here, you can select what kind of roles you want to go. For example, if I want to be a data analyst, I'll click over here. And for data analytics, I also selected this certification parameter and this is the certification which you can go for. Now, if you are going to click, you are going to get to know this page which I also clicked it over here, DP100 exam which is for data analyst associate certification. I'm gonna which is for which is for data scientist associate certification so I'm gonna click over here and let me just go back over there just to show you one more thing like over here this is my portfolio as I mentioned that I can show you my profile so this is my profile where it's gonna show you all the activities now you can go down and you would see that I have completed so many learning challenges over here there are a lot guys Trust me, you would learn over the period of time and you can complete any number of challenges, applied skills, certifications, etc. For more information, you can also connect with me on my LinkedIn profile. There also you are going to get all the information or just email us at connect.biconsultingpro.com where you can ask any kind of help if you are really in need for some more information. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel, which is BI Consulting Pro on YouTube and join us if you really want to take advantage of career guidance or maybe your resume review or maybe you want to learn something more. We are there to help you guys. We are there to help you guys. So don't worry about that. Now, how to do that? Well, first of all, you have to come to this one. So I don't need to review. I don't need to renew my certification, but there's another one which is pending. So I have to renew that one as well. Now I'm coming over here and here you find a lot of different sections like you can prepare for the exam practice for the exam take the exam renew your certification and all those sections are over there you can learn from there as well so anytime if you want to do a certain certification first learn from the microsoft documentations then watch our video tutorial series if we have already created for that particular certification and then practice exam question and answers that's how you can prepare you for your certifications in three simple steps and you can get success for sure now I'm going to register for this exam as I told you. So first I have to click on this take this exam and here you can see that in United States its fee is 165 USD. You can also check for your own country for example if I'm going to check it for this country and here it's just 80 USD. So it depends on the country where you are living you may, pay, you may have to pay some extra taxes or some extra fee. But I'm not going to go into this. I'll simply click on this schedule my exam. It would automatically take my profile if I have already created and please create it. Now I'm going to click on next. 
please do verify your all the details and here you will see that i have discount for this exam because i am microsoft certified trainer and here i can claim up to 75 percent of the discount like you can see over there in any case this is not appearing for you and you already have one exam voucher which i can show you over here like this kind of voucher you are going to get it so if i have this exam voucher what i can do i can simply come over here i'm going to go to next tab here and then i can click on schedule with pearson and up to certain time you can also reschedule it if you are not ready for that i always take my exam at my home i don't go to the center but if you are taking your exam at home please don't forget to check all the system settings over here so i'm gonna click so these are the different settings please do click on them one by one and check i have already checked a couple of times so i'm not gonna go there here you have to select your english language or if you are a german or french you can select your own language then please don't forget to read all the instruction on these screens and then click next you have to also read it over here i'm checking all these options because i already know what are these and once i do everything over here then you would go at the bottom and you click agree because you are agreeing with all the policies of pearson before appearing for this exam now you can click next and yes this is my time zone because i live in the netherlands or holland you can also call it i say yes this is correct and here i have to schedule my exam so i'm gonna pick one date over here all the available dates are there for example i pick 24th and then i click next i'm sorry i already picked one date so you have to check your timing over here i say okay book this appointment and here you will find certain more details like which exam you are scheduling for what it's going to be your appointment and if you really want to buy a book from microsoft to prepare for your exam you can use it and you can see that after discount i have to pay 49 Point nine one euro over here so i'll click proceed and here you would find this option promo code so you can remove that if you really don't want to use this 75 percent if you already have a hundred percent discounted voucher which i had and i have scheduled one of my ai associate exam but if you don't have then i'll stick with this one if you are already microsoft certified trainer then you can avail this otherwise you can simply remove it from here and here you can click add and you can apply this and say apply and now I'm getting 50% discount. So this voucher that I had, it's for 50% discount. Do not use it. It's mine. So please uh, learn yourself and earn something your own. And do not find any shortcuts. Please do remember that there's nothing like free lunch in this world. And over here, if Microsoft is giving you this free voucher, that means you have done your hard work in order to earn this one that's really important guys and then you can click next and you have to select your payment option so please use one credit card for this purpose and that is going to be very helpful for you and then you can click next and you can submit it so that's all about earning a microsoft free certification grow in your career with a particular path and how you can schedule your exam with that discounted voucher if you have any question and concern, please do let me know in the comment section. Also, guys, please don't forget to share this video with your old friends and colleagues or maybe on your LinkedIn profile or Facebook profile so that other people can also take advantage of this. I know you do a lot of hard work and your money is well earned. So do not just waste it. Rather than that, be smart, learn more, grow in your career and try to learn more opportunities to get free certifications or claim from your own organization. That's all you need to know. I'm going to see you in the next video. If you have any more feedback or any suggestion, please don't forget to let me know in the comment section. Till then, keep learning and keep diving into the world of data. I'm going to see you in the next video.